and we really won't know we're gonna have to tilt it up to access where the bees are and everything that's okay and i'm, I'm sorry but that is about really the right way to do it yeah, you know, that, and they will you know, come back and we yeah. will be back and yeah it might be job security but it's no good for you yeah go that way, right? right but we really i mean you guys can watch from the window you have an absolutely beautiful acre right here Telling Julio, it's like, well, ma'am, too bad you have bees in your barbecue and your dog house and your bird house and your trampoline. We're just gonna take it all. <laughs> and the cattle and the Cadillac. That's got bees. <laughs> that's telling that's how we got that barbecue up. That, that was the one Josh and I did. So anyway. Yep, and that's how we got the exercise box. Got the what? The exercise box. Yeah, the exercise box and. Uh, Actually, I got the whole ranch that way. Nice. Yeah, I would, and I said, "Boy, you got 85 beehives." I'm sorry, ma'am. Okay, we're, we're leaving. Right. It was <laughs> anyway. Beautiful morning, Sierra Vista. Here we are, and uh, we have. A, it's not the birds and the bees today. It's the dogs and the bees. That doesn't make any sense. Anyway, we have a big ass dog house back here. They know the bees have been under it for a month. Just, these are classically a nightmare, and so we're gonna have to tip the doghouse over. And I told her, we're taking the doghouse home because new bees will come back. It's happened every damn time. And her husband wasn't too happy about that because he built it. But Amanda and I just got a dog yesterday. Josie is a therapy dog, and the therapy dog needs therapy. Needs a, a handicap. <laughs> and so uh, we're gonna we're gonna take this doghouse and and hopefully Josie likes it. It's a big ass doghouse. So funny. On, we get booked for a doghouse and then we get the dog. Yeah. Right. See. <laughs> So this woman is adorable. She read online that if you put a, a uh, thing of Lysol, I've never heard this before. Oh, could you unlock the passenger side of that in case we need to hop in? Um, you put a thing of Lysol out by the bees and cut a hole in it, the bees are going to die. Well, apparently, it worked a little bit. We're going to see here. <laughs> Woo! So she's got a bunch of dead bees in here, but yeah, that's... That's adorable. Anyway, you could, of course, 1,500 to 2,000 bees are born every single day, so that, this is nothing. So we're gonna put it over here. And we're gonna put it move that stuff out of the way. All right, well, yeah, let's go ahead and lift this puppy up and we'll see what's under it. Whoa, we got bees. Ah, oh, wait, look at that. Oh, Holy shit. a little bit longer. Man, look at that. Look at I that. I think we got some. Oh, they killed a mouse. They killed a mouse, is what they did. That's little... Where is it? Right here. Oh, there it is. They killed two mice. Look yeah. at that. They killed a whole family of mice. Yeah, they did. They have a little nest. Dog. Two nests, it looks like. <laughs> So they aren't really too bad, so if we can get away with no spray adhesive for now, let's get the buckets and the scraper. No spray adhesive? Uh, no, yeah, I mean, they're not going nuts. Over here, a little. Listen. Yeah, let's just go ahead and whatever we can scrape up without... Wow, isn't that pretty? Huh? Yeah, do you hear the dogs? The neighbor's dogs. The neighbor's dogs, <laughs> yeah. Not not these guys. Thank you. Oh, that's right. Jeff, they picked that up. Oh, my goodness, it's beautiful. Okay, yeah. Okay, we'll get that. There we go. Alright, beautiful, huh? Now, this is brood. Do we have a bag? Yes. Look at how beautiful. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Let's make sure the old man isn't standing outside. Could you look over there? Yeah. Oh, he is. He's outside? Yeah. You need to get back in your house. He can't hear. Oh. God damn it. Shit, let me brush you off then. Gene, go back, 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 go back. Well, we just have to make quick work of it. 
God, I hate that so much. He'll run, he'll run into the bedroom. Yeah, no shit. Uh. All right, uh, what do you do with the scraper? I'm trying to open the scraper. Thank you. You have the scraper here? I have it right here. Thank you. Jeez, I hate that when old men don't listen. Don't listen. I hate it when anyone doesn't listen. <laughs> Oh, it's not, not beautiful. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely gorgeous comb. Stand up. It looks like it was just made in the factory. Yeah. The <laughs> beaver. Man, what a yard for a dog. Yeah, no lie, huh? <laughs> what a yard for some bees. A bee yard. It's big. Did you see oh. a tarantula? Did you see a dead tarantula? Oh, right here, look. All these. I don't know what. Look, there's even a... Uh... What are these called? Snail. Snail. Wait, how do you say them in Spanish? Um, kill the snail. <laughs> I don't even remember how you say in Spanish. I don't think I've ever learned. <laughs> I don't think I've ever learned that word. Yeah, I've never learned snail. Snail. Well, it's not a word that we say very often. Right? <laughs> it is. Um, it is. <coughs> Grusano, but that's worm. Yeah. Right? Caracol? Yeah, caracol. That's what it is. That's what it is. Yep. Yep, that's what it is. And how I know is when I lived in Oaxaca, the I learned that the Zapotecs used to get blue dye for their textiles from a snail that was in the ocean right by the shore. And I would actually go harvest them. Wow. And if you... Mm -hmm pick them up and turn them over and blow on them, they exude blue dye. No way. And that was where the dye came from for their textiles. And that's why the elite wore purple. That's why what the elite wore purple? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I guess that's my be. That's cool. Because it was rare. Yeah, definitely. It was definitely rare. We want to get it so that we can fill Or I can do it however you want. I can... No, we don't want to roll it that way. Oh, okay. No, 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 no. R, not for race. <laughs> the other R. Okay. Yep, yep. Keep coming. Okay, keep straight back. Yep. Crank it some more, like you were. And hold it. I only attached the coin sitting on its wing. Okay, I got bees on my glove. And my glove ripped. Ah. <laughs> Want me to get you a new glove? I'll get you a new glove. Thank you. Okay, if you push while I do that, 
doing okay, Julio? Oh, yeah, I'm doing good. Right, okay. it was fine. I'm warming up. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. Jeez. Um, so, well, we did it. We got the doghouse. Got it on the truck. On the, um, it's a heavy son of a gun. It, it says bear. No, there's a bear in it. I like a full-grown bear. It was just heavier than hell. So now we're going to drive off and um, and uh, have Julio take it back to the ranch, and Amanda and I are going to go have breakfast. Yay! So that's how that worked. We did it, guys. We saved saved the everything once again. So, uh, killerbeeguy.com. Don't forget. Come on, let's go. Ahead.